Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to more DuckTales Remastered. Uh, this might possibly be the last level. Um, I'm not certain. Yep, that's the last level. Can you read that? Can you read it? Hi, Rose. Amazon. The Amazon. Blank. Oh, you are very close. The Amazon. What? Oh yeah, I know. They hear you. They hear you because your voice is tiny and little. Get launch pad on the horn. I'm headed to the Amazon jungle to find the scepter of the Incan king. The scepter of the Incan king. Oh, no, we're going in the helicopter again. I'm going alone this time. Just me and launch pad. Look at oh man! Look at that mean bee down there. I know. Maybe there's gonna be. He's gonna airdrop bees. him in. Thanks for the lift, launch bud. No problemo. Lift is one of my favorite principles of aerodynamics. Oh, say, you got your radio, Mr. McD? Hi, hey, of course I do. Great. Then I'll be your eyes in the sky. Oh, I'd be happy if you just keep your eyes on the sky for once. What an airhead. Hey, I heard that. Now then. Ancient Incan legends claim the King's Scepter was locked away in a giant temple of the clouds, and it should be dead ahead. Gee, Mr. McGee, I see a lot of clouds, but no temple. You wouldn't, launch bad. The legend says the temple was hidden away from all but King Manco Kapwak like himself. But there's bound to be a way to reveal it buried somewhere in this overgrown salad bowl, and I'm not leaving till I find it. Okay, you try it, Blank. So Man, look at me, Gorilla. He's gonna come for you. He's coming! Oh, dear. You, gotta, you gotta jump and press the B button, Blank. You gotta jump and press the B? Yeah, there you go. Ow. Uh, You're missing all those treasure chests, dude. What the heck are you doing? Go back. I don't, I don't know how to do this. Jump it. There you go. Do it again. You gotta be able to hit two buttons at once, pal. Blaine, you are leaving treasure chests. You are making me frustrated. I'm trying to get up there, because there's two treasure Look, or it's X. You jump, and then you can hold X. You see? I'm good. Oh, they're fine. Launchpad, I found an ancient coin depicting a nightingale. Indeedo, you haven't stumbled across a pizza joint down there, have you, Mr. McDee? I'm getting kind of hungry up here. Uh, I'm not even going to dignify that question with a response. Okay, you want to try it again? Uh -huh. Good job, and then hold X. Don't do it on that flower, though. Tired. That actually looks like a snake. Jump button, buddy. Hey. Come on, look at that beat. He's coming for you. Here, let's go. go. Oh. Hurry. You gotta go fast. Hey, you're missing the thing. Oh. You gotta, you gotta jump up and you gotta pogo stick up and get those the vines, buddy. I can't do it. Okay, then let, I'll just play that. Yeah. Yep, you're just not understanding the concept. It's okay. Yep, you're not mad at you. Why would I be mad at you? Another coin, and this one has an inscription of an eagle. An eagle. Aha! 
a coin bearing the image of the Queen's horse. Ha, it'll help us find the treasure for sure. How can you tell, boss? Never doubt the well-honed instincts of an experienced treasure hunter. If you say so, Mr. McDee. Ooh, I've never seen a gem like this before. Should we go up or down? No point in Let's go down here. and down to see what they do. Okay. Oh, it's a good choice, Mike. Yep, this is a treasure chest. And inside a there coin is a coin. Another Some coin? Gads, yeah. I nearly tripped over it. This place is a mess. Where's Mrs. Beakley when you need her? You only have two hearts. Need... I do only have two hearts. It's not good. Yep. Oh, I should have. Oh, 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 I gotta be careful. Ouch. Oh, thank god, a cake! A delicious cake, Blink. Whoa. Yeah, let me give you a full health. Ah. You need a cake? That's for Oh. You got one. Oh, look! Oh. All these points. Look at this. An ancient coin with the image of a scythe. It must a represent scythe? a good harvest. This is Launchpad calling Mr. McDee. What is it, Launchpad? I'm running a little low on fuel up here. Well, where are the extra fuel canisters? <laughs> That's why I'm calling you, boss. I checked the glove compartment, but all I found was gloves. Oh. You'd best find those fuel canisters, but the next thing you'll be flying is a model airplane. Okay, okay. Last time I asked you for help. Is that a promise? Hey, get on, thing. We'll show them when we do a, a video about our con. The ruling huh? might of a spear. This is Launchpad, Mr. McDee. Come in, Mr. McDee. Launchpad, what was that? Uh, uh, nothing, boss. I'm sure nobody was using that tree anyway. Uh, except maybe them. And them. Well, that sounds terrible. You have the launch pads, okay? Onward and upward. Do you the launch pads, okay? Yeah, it's probably... Yeah, boy. Ow, ow, ow! Oh, there's an up here, too. Yep. I'm right. Look at this one. It shows a shield. You know, I bet those Incans could have minted a whole lot more coins if they hadn't tried to make each one unique. Right. 
Another coin! Aha! This coin bears an image of the scales of justice. Scales just of what justice. I need to help me find the scepter. You know, Mr. McGee, I had a thought. Launchpad, why start now and spoil a perfect record? That's a good question. Well, I don't have all day. What was your thought? Come to think of it, uh, I forgot. <laughs> Launchpad, were you dropped on your head much as a child? Balls. Oh, look at this thing. God, I hope I have all the coins already. Come in, launch pad. I found something. There's a carving of Monko Copquack on this stone slab, and there's eight circular notches around it. Sounds great. Does it tell us how to find the treasure? Well, I'm not sure what it tells us, but I'm certain it's an important clue. Bless me, bagpipes. These coins I found will fit perfectly into those notches. Yeah. Oh, you must have come across an ancient Incan poker table, Mr. McD. How about I come down there and you deal me in for a hand? We're already crashed somewhere. You I wonder come if this down is like... here and I'll deal you a blow to the head. You're supposed to be keeping an eye out for trouble, remember? <laughs> All right. Trouble spotting it is. Launchpad. What if the images on these coins symbolize the various tribes of Monko Capquack's empire? Maybe Capquacks. if I surround him with them. Yeah, I got all the coins. Oh no, it's not working. Hey, maybe you need to say the magic words. What? Maybe not. <laughs> oh god. Look at that guy. Will you look at that? The ancient city of Manco Capquac. And that beam of light, it must be pointing to the Temple of the Clouds. But how am I going to get across? Up here, Mr. McD. How are you still around? I thought you crashed. Follow that beam of light. Huh. I thought he crashed. Oh, man. Go along with the ride here. Eh, diamonds. There's a bunch of beams of lights. Ah, got that one. Put that one. He needs a bunch of beams. Yeah, beams like. <laughs> oh, I did it! I found a legendary temple of Manco Capquack. With a little help from your old pal, Lodgepad McQuack. <laughs> oh, of course, Launchpad. I couldn't have done it without you. Now just hold on, and with a little luck, that scepter will be mine in no time. Uh -huh. No point in hanging around here. Would you look at the size of this diamond? Oh, secrets. You are always good at this game. Yep, I'm always good at finding secret coin. I was trained as a treasure down. There's a treasure chest there. I was trained as a young boy. You thought that was a box too, but it was a treasure chest. No, I knew it was a treasure chest. Oh, there's a treasure chest. Oh, no, 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 no. Hey, look at that guy. Oh, he's dead. Good. Like a weird dog. Hey. Ah. This... Because of that. Did I see another one of those? I don't remember. Yeah. That was a lot of. That was a ton of diamonds.
Oh, what? I think the I have a king scepter. There it is, the king scepter. <laughs> oh, this was easier to find than a penny in a parking lot. Yeah, there it goes. Gosh, oh man, what is this? What was that? Oh my god! Oh my god! Make things fall. Make things fall. Always scary statue with red eyes. Oh! Oh, just go back in a sec. No, How are you in here with that? I'm not leaving without that scepter. Get us out of here, launchpad. Ugh. We lost the scepter. I can't believe we came all this way for nothing. What's the meaning of this? Outsider. Our prophecies have long foretold that our ancient city would one day be returned to us. For hundreds of years we have waited, and at last that day has come. You mean you're not mad at me? Mad? Quite the contrary, Feathered One. Is there anything we can do to repay you? Well, How did these no, tribal people from the Amazon know English? I did come here looking for an ancient scepter. I didn't suppose... Does it look like this? 
it fit. <laughs> All that climbing for nothing. Hey, Mr. Uh. McD? Bless me, bagpipes, the scepter of the Incan king! It is yours. Take it and go in peace. After all, it was just the old king's back scratcher. <laughs> <laughs> what a ridiculous, what a ridiculous fucking point in the story. Oh man. So that's all. I think that's all. I think that's the whole, the whole game, pal. I think. I'm not sure. We'll find out here in a minute. Well, maybe there's harder levels. We did happens. it, boys! All five treasures are mine! <laughs> uh, boys? <gasps> Sorry, McDuck, but your meddlesome nephews are a wee bit tied up at the moment. Flint Heart Glomgold, you put the Beagle Boys up to this. Guilty as charged, Scroogey. I've been oh, the man. second richest duck long enough. <sighs> but these treasures Webby, will soon change that. <laughs> I still on my treasures. Oh, tell your goons to release my boys. Not till you fork over that last treasure. Don't do it, Uncle Scrooge. Don't do it. The way I see it, MacDuck, you're not in much of a position to argue. It's not a very good safe if they just uh, broke into it. You drive a hard bargain, Glumgold. Take it, you filthy cheat. <laughs> <laughs> Flint Heart Glumgold, the richest duck in the world. How does it feel to be number two, Scroogey? <laughs> oh, God, what's he doing here? Magic or dispel? Oh, it's so rude of me to drop in unannounced. What are you doing here, Magica? Oh, quick, somebody sound the alarm. Duckworth, Mrs. Beakley, call the Pentagon. They sell me stock and bonds. Not so fast, Scrooge. Black a Rudy, Uncle Scrooge. I can't move. Me Whoa. neither. Now I know how a statue feels. Eh, greedy old fools. These treasures are far more valuable than money. And just what do you mean by that? You find secrets hidden inside old painting, yes? Painting of Drake Von Bloodstone. Also Can known as House Dracula Duck. These treasures it, are part of spells to summon him. Okay. Bah, what rubbish. You what, will what rubbish. see with power of Dracula Duck under my command. I will rule the world. There's still all the treasures. Unless, uh, you'd rather surrender number one dime, Scrooge. Dime is much gentler way to conquer world. We'll save a great deal of trouble. Also, less risk of accidental Dracula bite. The first dime I ever made? Never. Then I will take precious methods yeah, honey. instead. Get you up, will no. bring me dime Move quickly out. enough after that. Don't get that. underneath my desk, please. No, you're not. Hey, Dimses are hostages. Find your own. Quiet, piggle boys. <laughs> oh, I guess you turn them into pigs. Right now. now I take leave. Bring number one dime to my home on Mount Vesuvius in 24 hours, or little nephews will become Snackula for Dracula. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Everything's going so ridiculous right now. <laughs> oh dear. Sometimes I still get carried away. That lousy, no good so and so. I stole those treasures fair and square. This is no time for belly aching, Glomgold. I've got to save those boys. Ha, forget it. That she devil's long gone. You can't catch her now. Maybe you're right, Flinty. Uh, that leaves me no choice. How about a deal? You help me get the boys back, and you can keep the five treasures. Without your dime, I'll become the richest duck in the world, and you'll be nothing but a shriveled up old has been. <laughs> that dime's not worth ten cents next to the safety of my boys. Do we have an agreement? Are you joshing? It's a deal. 
You know what I think, McDuck? I think you've gone soft. You've <laughs> let those pesky rugrats become a business liability. And I'm gonna be the richer for it. Oh, go suck your head. Where's this going? Was him the same, the Where's boys? Launchpad? Where's Launchpad? Where the hell was Launchpad? That's... It's a start to this level. Plenty. Help me rescue the lads, and the treasure is yours. You keep up your end, and I'll keep up mine. Uh, Alright, well, I'm out of money now. I have zero money. What happened to all my money? Okay. This is probably a good place to cut you guys because we have. What? Yeah? We have a convention to go to, Blaine. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bye! Thanks for watching, you guys. Uh, sorry this was, this one was a little long winded. We just kind of sat here watching the cutscene, but uh, this game's a lot more story driven than I thought it was going to be. Alright, until so next time, thank you guys so much for watching, and shit, I keep repeating myself. Until next time, please be kind to each other, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. Bye.